wearing belts? If so, you're not alone. So many women in Not So Skinny Style School have told me how they don't like wearing belts and they say something along the lines of, I'm just not a belt girl. But when you allow yourself to wear belts, you are opening yourself up to so many more fashion possibilities. I mean, there's a reason why in the Devil Wears Prada, they were obsessing over which belt to pair with the outfit. Belts have an essential place in your wardrobe. They can make a dress or a top more figure flattering, and they can even keep your pants up. Wouldn't it be great to love belts and not be uncomfortable or self-conscious when you're wearing one? Hi, I'm Crystal Cave, stylist to Not So Skinny Women and the creator of Not So Skinny Style School. After working with many women, I've discovered that it's not about whether you are or aren't a belt person. It's all about the underlying issues that your belt is triggering for you. So in this video, I'm going to provide several tips that will help you do the impossible and fall in love with belts. First up, I want you to get real with yourself. Do you dislike belts because they make you feel self-conscious about your stomach? I recently had an encounter in a Lane Bryant dressing room. I tried on a dress and said, wow, this dress is cute, but it definitely needs another belt. And the sales associate said to me, oh, you don't need a belt, that dress looks great. So I began coaching her on why she was anti-belt and found out that belts bothered her because of her curvy stomach. When you wear belts, do you feel self-conscious because of how the belt hits your tummy? If the underlying issue is that you have trouble loving your belly, I really recommend you check out my video on how to love your stomach. It has some great tips for how you can embrace your tummy and any other body part that you feel anxious about. Okay, second, I want you to check if you are wearing the belt in the right place. Your belt should hit you right at your true waist. Many of the women in Not So Skinny Style School were confused about where their waist was. Your waist is not at your belly button. It's actually located between your belly button and your bust. It's an easy trick for finding this is to bend to one side. The crease that that creates is your true waist. When your belt rests at your true waist, it helps to create the most figure flattering look with your outfits. When things fit us poorly, we tend to feel insecure, and of course, we also feel uncomfortable, which leads me to number three. Is your belt too tight? If you're sitting in the office all day with your belt digging into your stomach, and then of course you're going to hate belts. The comfort aspect is something I totally get. I suffered from fibromyalgia for over a decade, and having anything touch my body just felt so invasive. It wasn't until I started to express my acceptance of my body that I was actually able to get better and have things touch me more closely. If your belt is uncomfortably tight, it's time to loosen it up a notch. And if you run out of holes, no problem. Just say hello to my little friend. It's a hole puncher, but for your belt. This is super great for not so skinny women since so many times we find a cute belt only to be frustrated that it doesn't fit. I've successfully used this for a number of my belts, including the one I'm wearing right now. It's super easy and kind of fun to do as well. So what tip will you put into action? I would love to hear your thoughts in the comment section below. You can also click on the link below to visit my website where you'll find info on some of my favorite belt resources. For access to some more awesome videos, just like this one, you can subscribe to my YouTube channel, Crystal Cave TV. Remember, great style has no size. You can feel amazing in the body you are now, and you deserve to show that world the special sparkle you have both inside and out. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you next time on Crystal Cave TV.